The majority of Rajasthanis follow the precepts of the Hindu religion, characterized by concern for harmony with nature. The animals who represent the multitude of forms that the gods of the Hindu pantheon borrow are closely associated with daily life. In the streets of the towns, monkeys live free, totally at one with the humans. The most sacred of all creatures, cows are the object of absolute veneration. For thousands of years, they've enjoyed the respect granted to the gods, and their slaughter is strictly forbidden. Born, according to tradition, at the same time as the high caste of Brahmins, they are the perpetual source of milk and butter. In spite of the existence of an absolute god called Brahma, the Hindu pantheon counts some 33 million deities. This sanctuary is dedicated to the god Ganesh. Represented by a man's body and the head of an elephant, it protects travelers, merchants, and even thieves. Each day around the temples, the crowd of believers comes to perform the puja, the prayer and the Hindu sacrifice. The faithful who come here to render homage to the god Krishna leave various offerings and recite prayers. In the temples, men and women of different castes come there by the thousand and there's a constant increase in the number of sanctuaries. This marble temple in Jaipur was built only a few decades ago with donations from a local rich Hindu. In Jodhpur, the Jaswan Tata Mausoleum complex was built at the end of the 19th century to house the memorial dedicated to the Maharaja Jaswan Singh II. In the Hindu tradition, the dead are not buried, but cremated. So this mausoleum doesn't contain a tomb. Out of respect for the important celebrities, cenotaphs are often built in their memory, in the same place where they were cremated. This cenotaph tradition, called Dowal, is peculiar to Rajasthan, where respect for the memory of its great kings is commonplace. The city of Jaisalmer is one of the big centers of the Jain religion. Here is one of the most beautiful temples dedicated to this particular religion, which is very different from Hinduism and closer to Buddhism. Developed in India since the 6th century BC as a reaction to the rituals of the Hindu Brahmins, Jainism has very austere ethics. While recognizing the existence of some deities, Jainism denies their participation in the creation. Its doctrine is centered on the teachings of a school and lineage of prophets. In the 16th and 17th centuries, the Jain community of Jaisalmer built this series of temples on several levels, connected by narrow passageways. <laughs> 